Hello everybody, Lusty here. Welcome back to another Dead by Daylight video. So today I'm going to be playing as The Blight, the new killer that is available in the PTV. And I must say that I'm not disappointed with his design. He looks very cool, and I love the random twitching that he does. His free teachable perks are Dragon's Grip, Hex Blood Favor, and Hex Undyne. Dragon's Grip makes it so that after you kick a generator, for the next 30 seconds, the first survivor that interacts with it will scream, revealing their location for 4 seconds and becoming afflicted with the exposed status effect for 60 seconds. Hex Blood Favor blocks all pallets within a 16 meter radius whenever you hit a survivor with your basic attack for 15 seconds. Hex and Die makes it so that whenever a Hex Totem is cleansed, the Hex will be transferred to an available Dull Totem, unless there aren't any left. His power allows him to break into a sprint, and if you bump into something while sprinting, you'll be stunned for a short duration and get the ability to break into another sprint, in which you're able to attack survivors. Basically, you can chain your sprints by constantly bumping into things and keep on sprinting until your meter runs dry. And yeah, with that all being said, I think it's time to get into some gameplay. If you guys do enjoy the video, be sure to give it a like so other people that might be interested can see it, and without further ado, let's get right into the first match. Alright, we got the temple. So right off the bat, I feel like the best... I feel like general consensus is right off the bat, you just start using your mobility that you get for free. I mean, he's essentially like a hybrid of Billy and maybe the Legion, I would say. I don't really know what other killers I can really, you know, say that are very similar to him, but those are definitely the two that come to mind. Alright, so we have two survivors over here. This guy's very safe near pallet. She's gonna have Spring Burst. I'm just gonna get rid of her Spring Burst. And then immediately go back to this uh, Jeff over here. So he's out of his loop. That's kind of good. So the problem is I kind of need to make sure that I get a hit early. Okay, very nice. Get a pal out of him. He ran into a bush. You're very nice, Jeff. Jeff, are you okay, my guy? Let's gonna do this. Walk around. Oh my god, this shit's so hard to control. Alright, we have Tinkerer going off right here, so that means that somebody's about to complete this generator. Hello, Kate, how are you feeling today? Let's get a bump into this and then run back at you. Okay, I have no clue that was Spring Burst or me being a complete fucking doofus. Hello, Cheryl, I saw you hiding over here behind the tree. You're not gonna get away that easily, though. Alright, there you are. Okay, so sounds are really quiet on the BTB and I really have no clue why. I'm trying to mind game this somehow. Damn it. This is real. It is really hard to control. Uh, it is really hard to control his rush. Like, it's way more difficult than it looks. For some reason, like, they made the, uh, the turn speed really, really rough. And it's hard to work with. I'm just gonna leave the shell. I mean, I did get my hit, but I don't want to waste all my time trying to chase her. Hello, Jeff. Good to see you as well. Come on, let me cut this corner. <laughs> oh, no. He's so difficult to control again. Uh, I swear to God, this guy is like. It's like Billy, but really bad steering. So I'm like, I walk away, and then I'm just gonna lunge. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so that's my first, like, in two gen time. I mean, it, if this doesn't really show that he's. If this doesn't show that he's really hard to, can, to control, then I don't know what will. So they got rid of one of my totems, but since I have Hex on dying, uh, my rune is just gonna appear on a different totem. So that's really, really gonna cut. So I feel like it, I feel like it's a really, really good combination. You're gonna drop that. Very nice. Okay, I might as well just go for you. I mean, see if you have BT or not. What the hell are you spinning at? Yeah, okay, so you do have BT. That's good to know. Um, I'm gonna have to keep that in mind. I'm just gonna break this straight away, so he's immediately zoned. You're probably gonna try and take it for this, uh, for this Jeff over here. Okay, let's see if I can get him. Okay, for some reason I was- Oh, okay, because I didn't rush. I should've used my last token. That's the reason why I couldn't attack him. Okay, insane better, by the way. He's not double vaulting it. I'm gonna show my red stain here. Yeah, he's, this Jeff is definitely not stupid. He should probably not be going for him since he'll have uh, DS anyway. So I'm gonna go to this side of the map. Maybe try and control Frigid if I can. Hello? Kate, get to see you as well. I'm gonna, just gonna hit you and then immediately start checking on the other gens because I really need to protect this free gen. Oh, hi! Alright, hello, Fangman. You have a key that's good to know as well. You're probably gonna try and just, uh, I, I feel like, you know, on the PTB, almost any team you go against is like an SWF and comms. So, you're definitely gonna look for the hatch and just tell the other free what it, where it's at. Hello, Shao, get to see you. 
Um, Infectious Fright tells me that there's two people healing over there. So let's see if we can interrupt that. Get to see you guys. Can I please get through the fucking rock? <laughs> Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna go back for the Cheryl again because she might have Soul Guard since I do have um since that it, since that is reteachable and I do have Ruin. Okay, let's see where she went. Hello, Cheryl. Good to see you. Just gonna free you up if you don't mind. Okay, Ruin is still up because they keep cleansing the wrong totem. I mean, they did cleanse my ex and dying, which means when my Ruin gets cleansed, it's not gonna be replaced. But, you know, I still I still prefer losing uh, Undying over over Ruin. Okay, I'm just going to swing so I don't get my cooldown. I can pick you up. And then I'm just going to free a Nuker right in front of me. And if they, if they don't unhook the other uh, Cheryl, I might just... Okay, they didn't. I was going to try and patrol gens, but this is more important to me. I need to keep constant pressure on these guys or they'll just end up gen rushing me. This mobility is really sweet, though. For real. Okay. Fortunately, I had to bump into something at the end there. I'm just gonna let her go so she'll most likely have BTDS. I really don't care about that. I kinda just want my gens to. I just kinda wanna keep my gen pressure up. Okay, never mind. Hello, Jeff. Good to see you. I'm not gonna even bother trying to use my build. I'm just gonna try and get a filler pallet out of him because it's just a. Uh... Okay, hello? Insane spins by Jeff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're so good at clicking your flashlight, man. I mean, you spun me once. I mean, I've done better. Gonna go back to swing, get to see you fuckers. <laughs> right, you're gonna have DS, I'm just gonna slug you for a bit. I think she has like 25 seconds left, which should give me enough time to just slug her in the knocker afterwards. Okay, get to know that Jeff is over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna pretend like I'm gonna chase him and I immediately pick her up and he won't be able to get this flashlight save in time. Okay, very nice. He tried to go for it, which just means that he's wasting more of his time. Alright, Jeff fucked off, so I'll be able to just immediately get you on the hook and then go back for him. To rush into this fucking log. Very nice, hello K, good to see you. I see you trying to blend into the generator, but just so you know, your outfit does not have a tint of red in it, so it's not really gonna work. So you're just gonna try and loop this, she probably has that art, I'm not sure. I kinda wanna just fake out a lunge and then see if she'll uh, use it. Okay, let's see if you dead or no you don't. Oh yeah, never mind. She has spring burst, I forgot about that. I kinda just wasted my own time there. Alright, can you please stop teleporting after I hit you and just let me pick you up? Thank you. I can hear a thingman right next to me. Okay, Tinkerer, please let me get through time. Oh my god, stop fucking doing this shit to me, man. That's gonna literally cost me any gen. If it weren't for that happening, I would have definitely been safe. Right, come on, let me make this. I'm so upset. I am so incredibly upset right now. Because of this weird thing that because he gets stuck on nothing for no reason that literally just cost me my free gen and i'm definitely gonna lose the match that really really sucks i'm gonna go for this thing man either way she probably has dead art either she has life or dead art there's just no in between all right we're just gonna get you over this uh, the jeff's probably gonna come for the flash that saves i'm just gonna immediately pick you up facing the other way i can hear him coming just gonna look away from him very nice gonna look at him just to rub it in your face that so you can't blind me yeah how does it feel how does it feel to be late Really? We're gonna free man on hook instead of do gents? Are you serious? Okay, well Cheryl is here too. Okay, interesting. Don't know why I lunged there. For some reason it looked like I could, what was it? I was a bit gonna be able to hit that. Okay, that was the worst mistake you could have made. That was also the worst mistake you could have made. That was also the worst mistake this guy could have made. What are they literally throwing? I'm just gonna drop them. Okay, feel free to unlock, I'm totally fine with that. I have no clue what they're trying to do. There's a filler pallet in there. This guy's gonna have that already, he's gonna lunge. Use it, very nice. Let's get your back to the hook. Okay. You should not have committed to that. These guys literally have no clue what they're doing. Okay, well, this guy doesn't realize I'm just gonna use my ability. Okay, let's see where the other person was. Okay, I literally am clueless. I don't know what they're trying to do. What? This game is so good, dude. Okay, being spun like the fucking madman Jeff is. You're not gonna have that or this time, so that's good. Insane spins, my guy. If I'm smart, I should just slug all three of them and then see where it goes from there. Whatever, I'll pick you up. I mean, I guess they can reset. I'm clearly in advantage right now. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna lose some pressure by picking her up and then most likely uh, letting let one of them get picked up off the floor, but... Besides that, not, not a whole lot is, gonna, is really going to happen. 
But that segment still hasn't like helped any of her teammates. I don't know what she's doing. Okay, there we go. So I'm just gonna rump into this. Bump into that. Come on, dude! <laughs> Yeah, and little, like, in freelance like this, there's no chance of getting any mobility out of your um, power. Like, it's really, really weak. So we're just gonna go ahead and use, try and go for the BT. Okay, that's another grab. Three times the charm, right? Are you gonna give me a third grab later on? I really hope so, because you're literally... Oh. <laughs> nice. So Jeff did get unhooked. I mean, I, I guess he could have camped him, but let's be honest, camping is just fucking boring. Like, denying him of actually being able to play the match is just so not something I'm okay with. I, I know it would have worked in my own favor, but it's the PTB. I mean, like, I should just relax and just try to learn to kill you know? That's the only reason I'm here. See some faint scratch marks over here. Um, okay, there we go. Found the rest of them. I need to get rid of that. Uh, okay, well, that's just here. You're not going to be able to go through it, can you? Oh, that is adrenaline. Very interesting. All right, Jeff, just you and me, buddy. Let's see how good you are in a 1v1. I mean, we know you can spin, but that's basically about it. You don't have any other redeeming qualities besides your beautiful hair. Yeah, keys are totally not broken in any shape or form at all. Like, the thing is, the thing about this killer is, I mean, he's basically an M1 killer besides his ability. And, you know... He does have that art, let me keep that in mind, very nice. Like, I could try and use my ability in this free line to try and catch up to him, but I will just most likely get stuck and... <laughs> very nice. I would most likely just get stuck and then, you know, somehow... Somehow lose him. I would get stuck and if he, if like, in this in this scenario he didn't have Iron Will, but let's say he did have Iron Will, I would just get stuck, be stunned, and then in that time he could just literally walk off into some corner of the map and just be hidden. And I feel like... That's kind of the problem with this guy's power. I mean, he does get a lot of free mobility, and it does does open... It does give you many opportunities to go for interesting hits with his ability, you know? Like, I can really see some nasty clips being hit and posted on online, where people just run across the map and maybe, like, cut a corner by bouncing off of it, you know? I can definitely see the direction the behavior was going with this guy, but if we look at the overall performance of him, I mean, he doesn't really have that much pressure, because he... He lacks the insta down that Oni or Billy would have, for example. So, he's definitely a very interesting concept, and I can see some really nasty plays being made with him. But just his base skit alone, I don't really see him, like, as a high-tier killer. But, who knows, it's very early on, and things can change, so we'll definitely have to find out as we go on. Alright, well, GG's. Alright, we got Bad M Preschool 4. So right off the bat, I'm just gonna make sure that I use my mobility straight away. Hello, Fengman. How are we feeling today? Um, I'm literally stuck in a generator right now. Okay. <laughs> Interesting, I could not move, and I was definitely not part of the ability, because I tried it out last game and it seemed to be working fine after you uh There we go, never camp pallets. I did not notice that you would be nearby. I'm really stupid. I should not have done that. That was so stupid of me. I didn't. I mean, I thought I heard a Steve, but for some reason, I felt like it would be really far away. All right, I'm just gonna immediately read down you. I mean, we did get rid of a filler pal. It didn't really do much for them. Okay, you you sure you want to do this right now? Are you really sure you want to do this right now? <laughs> Alright, so what we'll do instead is then just slug you for extra pressure and then we'll just go ahead and hook you somewhere since you're not since you haven't been struggling. So I guess I'm gonna bring him over here. Wait, where why are there no hooks here? What the fuck? There's literally no hooks anywhere. That's a really good thing to know. I'm gonna make sure that I stab out of the hook every single time next time I play this map. Alright, let me please get this guy. You're not gonna make this very nice, and this time I'm actually gonna try and commit to hooking you because I don't even know if it's worth trying to commit to hooking her because um I don't know if it if, I literally don't know if there's any hooks nearby. Can you hear somebody running over here? Hello, Felix. How are we feeling today? Yeah, just keep running. Sure, give me a pre-hit. That thing man can't go anywhere now, so basically they're basically basically both screwed. Nice try, nice try, Felix. Very nice attempt to body block him, but I'm just gonna keep slugging this thing, man. Let me go! 
This poor Fangman has endured so much fucking- <laughs> This poor Fangman has endured so much bullshit. I'm just gonna make sure that I have a cue this time. I feel really bad for you. Alright, let's see if I can surprise him over here. Where'd you guys go? Hello? I know you just healed up. I kinda need to make sure that I actually get one of you. Okay, hello? Good to see you. I'm just gonna go and hit you. This same man's probably one of these two lockers. I'm gonna pretend like I would walk away and then just go back for her again. Let's see if we can maybe- Maybe I'll, I should be able to cut him off if I use my rush, but I kinda don't wanna risk it. Alright, I'm just gonna do this. Hello, thing, man. I knew you would be here. Mm, very nice. You really have to be careful that you actually trigger one of your rushes. You cannot attack by just bumping into something. Like, after you bump into something, you have to trigger another rush before you can actually attack. That's something that keeps fucking me over. Like, I keep trying to press M1 at before, like, pressing M2. But I really have to make sure that I press M2 first. Alright, you should have panicked about the back. But, you know, you're not gonna make this now. Alright, just gonna be somebody with a flashlight. I'm just gonna go ahead and pick you up. Somebody's gonna attempt the flashlight save, very nice. Please give me the free down. I would love it if you gave me a free down right now, that would be so nice of you. Okay. <laughs> Guess you're not that generous, are you? I'm already doing gen up there. I really couldn't be bothered with that generator since it's an upstairs gen. Like, it, it just gives me more pressure having that generator, uh... It just gives me more pressure to have that generator completed, so I'm gonna let them do that one. Alright, you're probably gonna have DS, so I'm gonna slug you. See this Felix in action. He's actually pretty good, he's definitely not bad. Let's see what he does. Trigger a rush, please. <laughs> oh my god, this is so fucking unbearable. Oh my god, this is so annoying. I just want to fucking walk and it just keeps bumping me into something that isn't even near me. I can hear him walking through the inside. Am I going to be stupid and chase him? Alright, hello thing, man. I see that you still have your DS. Did you just pop a stiftic agent? Okay, you did not. I'm still not going to pick her up because I don't know if 60 seconds have actually passed. I don't want to risk it. Hello, Felix. I can hear you over here. Alright, there he is. Has this pal been dropped yet? Yes, it has. Okay. I'm gonna be able to cut him off, but this guy's gonna have that art. I mean, a looper like this, who is this confident? He's gonna have that art. He's just gonna make sure that I hit you through the window so you can't use it. Very nice. Alright. I'm just gonna pick you up, good sir. And then it'll be looper for you to hook. I think the fuck not! Or not, I guess. I mean, I guess this Felix has other plans. You're gonna stab at that as well? Hey, yeah. Might give me enough time to, uh, yeah, I'm like, it's not gonna give me enough time. I'm just gonna have to drop you if you don't mind. Right, we're gonna just get our sweet, sweet revenge over here. Damn it. This is so hard. This is so much harder than it looks, guys. I swear to God. We're just gonna cut him up with her ability. Oh my god. Can I please just attack? That's all I fucking want. I just want to use my fucking cr I just want to use this stupid cane. He's gonna vault that. Very nice. Now he's cornered. Let's see if you have that art. No, you don't. Alright. I'm gonna throw this guy on the very hooky sabot. <laughs> Talk about irony. Okay, so there's a Felix and a Fingman over here. I'm gonna go for this Fingman. It would be very stupid of me to go for this Felix. I'm just gonna immediately pull out of this locker because this Felix is gonna try and go for the locker splash, let's say, but it's not gonna be quick enough because he's too far away. And there we go. Totally predicted. All right, let's see if we can get this Felix. Good to see you. Um, okay. Kind of strange that it did not connect, but I'm not gonna question it. I'm just gonna go and eat you. Alright, vault that pal gets her, no problem. I'm just gonna go out and try and see if I can stop any of these generators being worked on. The answer is definitely no. <laughs> I could have protected a pretty solid pre gen here, but oh well, you know, you can't have everything in life. Um, hello? Hello, Ash. Haven't seen you all match. Have you just been pressuring gens like a filthy little gem rusher? I bet you have. Alright, now I see why you were just gem rushing the entire time. I'm just gonna go ahead and slug you for a bit. Hello, Felix. I see you going for that flashlight save. I'll just pretend like I run into him. There we go. Get my first hit. I kind of want to pick up this Ash and then hook him because I haven't hooked him all match. Great. Hello. I have returned to you, Ash. Good to see you again. I feel like he's just running in a straight line. There's nothing for him to use in here. Gonna do this. Very nice. He's definitely a W gamer. Alright, I'm just gonna go right back to the hat. 
I'm definitely gonna go right back to the Ash right now. Damn yeah, it, I, I forgot to bump into something. This might actually work in my favor though, because now I can just M1 him again. Alright, you don't have better, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna look away and just pick him up, so I can get a hook. I can hear Felix in the basement, I think. I really can't be bothered trying to find him though. What's up? Mission failed. Hello, Ash. <laughs> Good to see you. What a coincidence running into you. Do you have DS? Are you gonna use it on me right now? No, you don't. All right, very nice. Hello, Felix. Good to see you. I'm just gonna go. Okay. This is what I mean with his ability just being very unreliable. I could have definitely just run towards that Felix and then hit him, but because I got stuck on nothing, I. Okay, well, unless you run into me, that way I actually will be able to kill you. <laughs> Hello, Felix. Good to see you. Are you gonna help your other teammate up? I guess you aren't. Okay. Okay, good pallet drop. Very nice. I'm gonna try and get him stuck in here. This is definitely not blastable, though. I will have to mind game him at some point. Hello, good sir. <laughs> Let me make sure that I hook the other Felix right here since he's next to the hook. Okay, never mind. He crawled away. This is what I was scared of. That's why I wanted to get him first. All right, I guess the hunt for the other Felix commences. All right, we're just going to go ahead and close this. Very nice. I did not have adrenaline, so this guy is definitely going to bleed out on the floor. Unfortunate. If you didn't try and, you know, crawl into the corner of the map to hide, I could have just hooked him and then, you know, sped up this entire process. But since he wanted to purposely bleed out, then, uh, yeah, I guess I'll let him do that instead. Alright, well, GG's.